Hey, 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 this is Sherry Brown coming at you from SherryBrownCoaching.com. Have you ever caught yourself having that scarcity mentality? If you get in the position of where you are thinking in scarcity, it does not serve you. It puts you in the wrong mindset, and honestly, it just makes you look desperate and unprofessional. I am in a Facebook group that includes, uh, you know, different reps from my particular network marketing company. And someone posted in the group that they had sent some samples to somebody and that prospect, that potential customer, ended up posting on Facebook and tagging them in it, talking about, you know, how much they like the products and things like that. Well, another rep jumps in on that post and says, you know, oh, I'm glad you like it. Uh, something about, well, too bad you didn't order from me. And you know, number one, why would you even want to put that customer in that, you know, in that situation? That's not cool. It's unprofessional. It, you know, just really put the customer in a bad place, in a bad position. And you should never, ever do that. There are over what? Like in, in the U.S. alone, there's what? Like over 300 million people. There are billions of people around the world. People aren't lacking. So don't try to jump in and just think because you see somebody is interested in something and, and you didn't get to them first. Well, you know, you're just going to jump in and try to put them in an awkward position because you just want to close that, you know, close that one person. Thousands of searches are done every single day from people who are looking for an opportunity. Thousands of people. I mean, every eight seconds, someone starts a home-based business. Know that it's okay. It's okay if you don't close everybody. You're not going to. If you catch yourself thinking or having that scarcity mentality, because all it does when you do is it takes you out of action. It gets you in the wrong mindset. So if you ever find yourself thinking in scarcity, instead of sitting here getting frustrated, take action. Go out there and start building your network. Start connecting with people and simply see if they're open. You don't have to sit here and try to, you know, snatch somebody else up or make yourself look desperate. If you're, you know, if you're running a business, you want to grow a business, you've got to have a little professionalism to you. If you see somebody else growing their business, be happy for them. Because what that does is it, sh it goes to show you what's possible in this industry when you take action. So stop beating yourself up. Stop, you know, thinking about, oh, who's out to get me? Or I, I wish I could have closed that person or I should have talked to that person. Stop thinking like that. Take action. You know, if you're on social media, chances are your perfect prospect is on there. Chances are people are looking for an opportunity. And you have the chance to take action and start connecting with people. See how you can help them. You know, see if you can serve them. If they don't join you, don't worry about it. Go to the next person. You know, stop, stop thinking negatively and stop thinking in scarcity because it serves no one. I hope you guys found value in this and mindset is very, very important. You know, listen to podcasts, read a book, get around people who, you know, are inspiring. Get around people who are doing way better because you know what? If you want to grow your business, get around people who have way more skills than you, start learning from them. And then that's going to make you better and you're going to stop worrying about all the crap that you can't control. If you like this and you would like more tips, feel free to visit my blog at sherrybrowncoaching.com. And enter your name and email address on that and you will get my success guide. Bye.